Good morning to you, Carl and Lisa. I'd like you to meet the Gemco players about once a month here at Puffing Billy in Belgrave in Victoria. They get on the train and entertain all of the guests with a little bit of a whodunit. They are dressed up in character this morning, walking by the train, looking very mysterious indeed. We'll hear a little bit about their performance right after we take a look at your weather and see what's happening at your place on this Wednesday. Starting off in Cairns, it is looking like a showery day up north, the top of 26 degrees. If you are in Townsville, partly cloudy and 27, 23 and overcast in Brisbane. Uh, and on the Gold Coast today, light showers on a top of 22. Partly cloudy in Sydney with a top of 20 degrees, 15 and cloudy in Canberra. In Melbourne, cloudy, much the same for Hobart and Adelaide with temperatures in the mid-teens. Overcast in Perth, a mostly sunny day for the Alice. And up in Darwin, you can expect clear skies for your Wednesday and a top of 30 degrees. Well, Kieran is one of the Gemco players who gets on board the Puffing Billy about once a month. Can you tell us about the show? Everyone's looking delightful this morning. Indeed. Well, uh, we start down here in Belgrave. We uh, get on the train, go up to Emerald for dinner, and while it's all going on, there's a murder Ooh. that happens. So I play the role of Detective Crawley, and I'm always on hand to investigate any murder. We have the fiancé, who's clearly very oh. upset. The, uh, the banker, <laughs> perhaps he has something to gain. And perhaps the Oracle can contact the deceased from beyond the grave. Oh, it's all very interesting. And about once a month, this happens on Puffing Billy. And as Kieran mentioned, you can have dinner in Emerald on that journey. You never know what you might have to investigate, Detective. That's right. Perhaps uh, the audience, too, can help us solve the crime. Mm, sounds very good indeed. We'll have more from Puffing Billy in the next little while, Carl and Lisa. Thank you very much, Emma. Be a bit worried about a bloke in my last jacket.